folks, welcome to the first festival of 2024. Jake's walking around with the door. There's a latch. Today we are going to Europe's biggest country music festival. Country to country. It's in Glasgow. This is Ryan. Ryan! Ryan is a good friend of ours. You're going to be seeing him this weekend. Ryan, tell us a fact about yourself. I work in music and I supply TBD with, with tickets. <laughs> a, he's a good lad though. Outside of that, he'd still be one of our best friends. So we're here at King Tut's, the best music venue in the world according to Radio 1 or something like that. This is where it starts. Now this isn't a part of C2C. This is like a matinee. Like you've got to pay an extra ticket for this. Well, they've got like a lot of country acts on. We're going to go in there now and see a little country act you may have seen singing in Walmart. Here's a fun fact for you about King Tut's. This is where Oasis were discovered. We've never been to a country music festival festival and I don't really know anything about country music but this is going to be a nice warm-up for a much bigger country festival we're going to later in the year so without further ado let's roll the titles get the video started it's time for the first festival of 2024 this week it's something completely new like we've never experienced in the past Europe's biggest country festival let's see what it's all about Country music has taken over the world in the last few years. And because of that, the demand for country music in the UK is higher than ever. That's why this week we're up in Glasgow at Country to Country, a festival dressed in denim and cowboy hats, bringing country talents to the UK from all across the world, but mostly from Nashville. Will it be any good? Will we end up liking country music? And most importantly, will it prepare us for the world's biggest country festival in a few months? We are TPD TV and you are watching The Real Deal. Yeah! An enormous thank you to our executive producers on Patreon. This video is 100% funded by you. If you want to support, click the link in the description to join now. You get early access to videos, extended cuts, exclusive videos from back in the day, and Discord access. Now on with the show. So this whole weekend, there's only one artist that I know, and we're seeing him twice today, and he's the first person that we're going to see. Mason Ramsey, who you might know by the name of the yodeling Walmart kid. And he better still be a kid. If he's grown up already, I'm going to be pissed off. Yeah! Woo, woo, woo. Thank you. Woo, woo, woo. How is everyone doing? Yeah! yeah! I'm going to take my horse to the wood town road. I'm going to ride till I can't no more. I'm gonna... If I want to be famous for something, I want to be famous for loving you. If I'm going to be known around the world, it's be because of you too. I got a feeling of the blues, oh Lord, since my baby said goodbye. Lord, I don't know what to do. All I do is inside. Was great. Like, like, there's obviously that novelty side to it, where it's like Mason Ramsey, the Walmart Yo Lincoln, genuinely really good. Like, good singer and good songs. I'm very impressed. Well, we'll see him again in about four hours. Oh, perfect. <laughs> So we've seen two artists so far, and you've got to remember, this isn't a part of country, country like, you know, what you buy a ticket about. This is a separate ticket costing this much, and it's great. Like, there's only three artists playing, but you're in an iconic venue, you hear some good music. I'm not really a country fan on paper. I think it's quite low level and accessible, but there's also a time for that. And it's nice to see two acts where I don't really know any songs and they're both really good. I think it's going to be a really good weekend. I'm excited for Mary to get here and experience yeah, it. Well, we get to spend some time in this great historic venue and then go over to the arena and have an even better time and it's going to be class. I'm just missing the cowboy hat. And Nashville hot chicken. <laughs> song on tour last year in every single, I would say more or less every single state. And sometimes 2,000 people, sometimes 4,000 people, and there's probably 250, 300 people here in Glasgow that sang it louder than every state in America. So come on, let's go. The 
Ryanair shows are done. Very good in there. Very good. How much is that, Ryan, if you're buying a ticket? Uh, 15 pounds. 15, 15 quid a day. That I'd was worth 15, 15 quid. quid. Just for Mason Ramsey. Same. So now we're going to have a wander over to the arena where the main country to country is. But before we'll be that, we're going to stop right. at a couple of bars, get run over, and get some food. So on our way to the hydro, we've stopped off at a bar called Strip Joint. Now, Strip Joint, for one, uses the Cheap Trick logo, which is cool. But it's also like a bar slash restaurant slash record shop. It's pretty cool, you know, and a nice little stop off to go to the hydro. If any representative of Strong Boys watch him right now, can you explain the rebranding? Because it's pretty sh. Oh, you dickhead. Absolutely delicious. Very, very good. Well done. That was bloody lovely. That was truly great. The only issue I've got here is I obviously had the peppercorn and all I can taste is like the peppercorn, which don't really taste well. It tastes good, but I don't really want that taste in my mouth. So anyone want a uh, cinnamon toothpick, you know, to add to the country vibe? You know what I'm saying, boys? How's it going, boys? Are we enjoying them? Yeah, man. You know, I fucking love this. Hey, shout out to the guys at Coachella Camp next to us last year because mm. they got onto these, got oh. us onto these. Stick it through there, yeah? Stick it through there. Perfect, yeah, stick it all the way through. <laughs> I've had these instructions before. <laughs> Can you taste it? Beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> I guess because I'm so used to seeing the Hydra at night when it's dark, but I never knew it looked like a fucking flying saucer. You know, like those sweets. They're really missing a trick because I wanted to buy a fucking cowboy hat. They don't. I've wanted, I wanted to appropriate some Western culture and I'm not allowed to do so. All right, we're in. We made it in. The ticket scanned despite Ryan sending us the lowest quality <laughs> QR code I've ever seen. Give this a scan. I bet it don't work. Are you excited? Thank you, Pardon. You're excited, I said. Very excited. Thank you, Pardon. Thank you, Pardon. Look, it's Thank called being polite. It's, not, it's called being a gym. So we're in a thing called the Hydro Club, which is like a VIP lounge. I don't really know what criteria you have to meet to get in here. Oh, it's nice in here, isn't it? It is nice in here. I mean, we have been in here before, though. Yeah, of course so. we have, but it's Did we fine. cover it on the vlog before? Um, 75. Did we actually put it in the video? Nice being in here. It, it, do you know what? Brilliant. It's just nice and calm above the storm because now there, you know, it's a bit, a bit rowdy. Queues for the bar. No queue. How do you get in here, Ryan? Through the door. Walk through the door. Ticket again, mate. Need your ticket to get in. What an idiot, man. Why'd you go to the wrong door? I was following Ryan. He's meant You're to... an idiot, man. Why'd what? you go to the wrong door? It's very strange being in a hydro when, when it seeks like... It we, came in here, we came in here for club one. Maybe a year ago, yeah. and it was full of like silks. It's over with one. And now we're all underage as well. Yeah. <laughs> all of them underage. And now we're here, seated. Tim, guy sent us in the wrong door. Perfect. Yeah, can we point it? We've been pointing back to the door. We've got turned away from. <laughs> That was good. How are you feeling about country now? I think it's great. It's good, I isn't it? Like country. Yeah, country yeah. Alpha. So these are the girls that we just saw in King Tut's at the matinee show, and now they're playing the B stage in the arena. It's a different set by the sounds of it, so pretty good. Where the sun shines bright. This is a really hard event to capture because it's all seating. You're only kind of seeing shots from like our seats, which is quite difficult, but rest assured, it's very good. This guy here, Brian, he was actually in a band called Florida Georgia Line, which is quite a popular band, but he is the most generic country singer you've ever, ever heard. He, all he does is sing about Jack, Trucks, John Deere, and all that type of shit. Yeah, 
not even a light zero. It's it's a straight zero. Please welcome Mason Ramsey. Woo! Great time at country to country. Everyone here is nice, a lot of positive vibes. It's very good. I'm really glad that Rob's enjoying it because I was a little bit worried. Three days of country music after he said to me multiple times that he doesn't like country music. I was a bit worried that he was just going to slay the thing, but he hasn't and he's actually really got into it and it bodes well for another festival we've got coming up later on in the year. It's all my Scottish friends stand by Country to Country Night One. Brad Parsley is called, named after the um, Parsley Stage Rosemary and Time, the old uh, riddle or whatever it is. I'm a bit drunk, but I'm looking forward to seeing Jeff Paisley. It's going to be good tonight. It turns girls on when I'm mysterious. I tell them I don't want nothing serious. Because even on a slow day, I can have a three way chat with two women at one time. So much cooler online. That's so much cooler online. Alright, so if you'd like to follow Carrie Hopkins 1990, go do it. <laughs> 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 Refresh it. He's not something in the middle of the night. No. <laughs> Stop sneezing. I don't have hair fever. Just fuck up. <laughs> oh, that is great. Seriously, <laughs> shut up. I'm trying my best. <laughs> Try harder. I've got a cough, right? I've got a cough. Well, stop having a Listen, cough. Where are we here, Ryan? Classic Grand. Classic Grand, yes. What is that? <laughs> Venue stroke club. I've never been in here before. First of... things first, I'm gonna have a piss. Oh, Coldplay. Ryan, you've been to see Coldplay, haven't you? A couple of times, yeah. I'm fucked. <laughs> You guys may not be as country as I am, but that was fucking sick. Like, I really enjoyed I'm not even taking the piss right now. I know I sound pissed, because I am pissed, but I'm not taking the piss. That was brilliant. Like, you don't get to hear those songs often. Everyone, no, let's, let's be serious for a second. Okay. okay. Let's say a prayer for the taxi driver who's sure. got to have three lads <laughs> with three, what's it called, Ryan? Sausage supper. Sausage, sausage supper. AKA sausage and chips. Loads of vinegar. God, in you that know, car. He had so much vinegar. It literally like poured out of the fucking box. <laughs> oh my God. That's what I like. Chippy tea, good. Good sausage. 
good chips. Time for bed. <coughs> oh, good night. Good night, Ryan. Night. Night. I've been sick. I don't feel very well. And I can't be arsed with a country for another day. Never mind another two days. Fucking hell. Sleeping on this airbed has fucked me up. I don't know how to do this for most of the year. It's a slow start. Fucking hell. We start essentially the same thing all over again. King Tuts for the matinee shows and then into the arena. I've had enough country music, I've decided. Oh, come on, man. It's gonna be great. You just need, you, you need a beer. Or a White Claw, or a cider. Ad time. Is College Road getting you down? Do you feel weak? You need source. It is okay, you can just drink your sauce today. <laughs> Patrick, saucy goodness. A Dover. We're back at King Tut's watching three bands or three acts I've actually never heard of before. I don't know anything about them, so this is going to be interesting. <laughs> oh, I, you know what? You have to plug the guitar in <laughs> in order to use it. <laughs> Story, I ran into Jelly Roll and I said, Hey, I love what you're doing for inmates. And he said, Come play a show with me. I said, Great, I'd love to go into prison with Jelly Roll. Well, Jill, what she was absolutely, I look like shit today. Fuck it up. She was absolutely, thank you, wonderful. And she's perked me up. What a nice loss. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm here. I've made it. I've got a bath. That was a long journey. I had to go from Leeds to Preston. The train was lovely but really warm, so I'm tired as fuck now. I really need to freshen up and get myself as countryfied as I can with my gowns. My attempt at country is probably the worst I've ever looked at any kind of festival. I've gone for my blue jacket and then a double denim vibe but they're completely different colours and I need to wear this jacket because it's cold and raining and then the worst part about it all I don't own any shoes that could be classed as country I don't like boots I like trainers I like to be comfy so looks kind of alright maybe and then we get to these pink nikes why did I bring my pink ones I look so mismatched and weird and everyone's wearing cowboy hats that I've seen and cowboy boots and they look so good and I just feel like a fucking dick. Uh, Preston was horrible because the football was on so I went to Preston and it was full of like Stone Island hooligans yeah. drinking but when I got on that Avanti coast it was really peaceful and nice. So we're back at the Hydro and we didn't tell you this yesterday but country to country there's three of them and they run on the same weekend kind of like Reading and Leeds do and there's one in London at the O2 there's one in Dublin at this venue and then oh. Here at oh. the Hydro. Is it not Dublin? <laughs> the Hydro. Hydro. Well, this isn't Dublin, for a start. That's not what I said. Oh, it, is, it is what you said. Check the tape. I said there's one in London at the O2. There's one in Dublin at this venue. Oh. At this venue. Pointing, because the text of the venue oh, is. Oh, sorry. And there's one at the Hydro. Ryan, what's the here at the Hydro? That's been depending on the production. What's the biggest show that's been in the Hydro, Ryan? I'm sure you'll know that. Oh, I'm good. And why is that interesting, Ryan? Because it was Ryan show. that ran that show, so everyone comment below saying, thanks Ryan, you are the only exception. What's the capacity? 10,000 10, tonight, so not very big. I wish Drake were in. That would be I good. Wish. Might, Muse. Was, everyone else would hate Muse that and world. Drake instead. That would be good. Show three, get it now, go dead, go, but don't you. There's never my blue suede shoes. Yeah. You can do anything when they open my blue suede shoes. I'm gonna do something that I've never done before. 
that I've always kind of judged people for doing. I'm gonna get some food in the arena and go watch the music with some food because I'm hungry. Queuing up at that place, all they have is like Korean burgers and Korean food and everything's got kimchi swore on it, which is fermented cabbage. I'm, I'm not really in the mood for that. So I'm gonna have a walk and see if I can find anything else. Right, this is the haul. I've got some chips and some fake ketchup, which is always not very good. It's like fake cola. It doesn't quite work unless it's Heinz. Chips are good, crispy. Ketchup, shit, too sweet. Five out of ten, four pound fifty, just FYI. King, even if you don't actually want to be there, make it seem like you actually do. Have a bit of enthusiasm. That was just dead, man. So apparently there's another stage in the arena. Not the same place that we've been every time we've come to the arena. Not there's the a secret stage. hidden stage like in here somewhere. A C stage. Isn't that what you have when you can't squeeze the baby out? Anyway, we're looking for the extra special secret stage in the Hydro. It's worth mentioning, at the other ones, the London one specifically, there's loads more stages, like not just three. This is why I don't like sharing toilets with men. Not only does it stink of shit in here, it's everywhere, all over the floor, seat. It's my shit trainers to... Luckily, he put the seat up, at least he's considerate in some ways. Um, instead of going in to see the main headliner, we're chilling in this live bit and we're going to see the, the girl that we saw in Tuts. It's been a tough day today. Exhausted. Truly exhausted and it's one day in. Am I getting old? I hope not, because this year's a busy one. What driftwood? Why are we going to driftwood? Look at my No! You having a good time? Do you want to talk to me or do you want me to say yes? <laughs> Let's explain this place. The majority of people weren't born when this song came out. You were like, what, 25 when this song came out? I thought that was a good vibe in there. Do you know what? It wasn't yeah, bad. I enjoyed that. Did you not like it, Mary? Um, it got good as soon as we left. <laughs> Perfect. Don't know what that really means. We're doing a bit of a bar crawl. We've come to a place called Variety, I think. And the toilets are cubicles and mini rhinos written on the door and the other one says cubicles so I've come in the cubicles one and this is what I see a toilet without a seat I'm gonna have to try not fall in but yeah I'm a bit drunk so I don't know what I'm doing this for <laughs> The good thing about this bar that we're in now is um, I'm kind of low on battery, so at least I can plug my phone in. I'm from the Vibe Preservation Committee and I think that texting or scrolling is bad if you want to have a good night. I don't want to see you on Facebook anymore. Right. All night. It's not 2013 anymore. We, every night, ruins my vibe. What's the vibe? Uh, litty, litty chicken. Oh no, we, we don't go back there. That was bad time. Where are we going? Vibe We're going to the next, next bar. Where are we going, Ryan? Next bar? Is it not? Firewater! Let's go to Firewater! We're in another spoons. Oh, for the love of fucking God. And it stinks as sick. It, why does it smell as sick? Yeah, why does the spoon smell as sick? Ready? Ready as I'll ever be. To a night. Yeah. yeah. Premium car? car? Are you crazy? It's, it's not. It I is. Think it's yeah, it's <laughs> thirty-nine thousand starting price. 
and it's so fucking fast. It's they're amazing cars, and you do not know what you are talking oh, about. Do you know how many you are so, I've watched? Yeah, and so have I. Yeah. So have I. Do you know how many years of my life I've been watching car? But this is a premium car. No chance. It is a premium car. You're not factoring. You're that just basing drive. it on the price. Is it on? What's the price? What? For? But that well, price factors in the sa the if enormous was, savings right. of fuel. You know what? Can I just say? And the government rebate. Get a dollar out of me. Get a lot of water, can't see. Going over the car. And the motherfucking beat away. What are you doing? Just studying. You said you were about to go and rock. What do you want from me? You just told me that you were going to go and rock. Yeah, we're going to go rock and roll upstairs. What? Are you, are you what, what do you want from me? Where are you? I've left house. I've got a wet jacket. I, I, I left it. Um, I, I was having a wee and then I left it on the sink. Not on the sink that was getting wet, but just on the sink top. And it got wet, but there's something creeping then. Uh, not necessarily. I mean, that's just in my head. I just want to cover it while I go out. So I'm wearing it. It's wet. I'm here at McDonald's, which is literally a, m a minute away. And then I've got my hotel just on that corner. So I'm going to get a piping up my keys. I'm going to go to bed. I might even, you know what? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get oh, a change, but I'm going to get a big tasty. I'm going to get a big tasty, a Big Mac, and maybe even a hamburger. But we'll see. I'll check it with you in a bit. Mwah. If you are Mackie's working or listening to this, because I order Mackie's on delivery maybe like twice a week, if not more. Why the fuck when I put times six or times eight curry sauce when I've ordered two plus meals, are you giving me two curry fucking sauce? What am I, a mouse? Am I having little nibbly bits. No, I'm not. I'm having a big ass meal. And this one makes me angry. It gives me two curry sauce. Do you expect me to believe you only have two curry sauce in your entire establishment and I'm just a lucky person that gets to get the last two. Look, I can say this as I used to win McDonald's for three ass years and it was shit and I know what it's like. But the fact that... Well, we've had a 3 a.m night tonight. It's been a long time since I've had one of these. I did not expect that at all. We're going to pay for it in the morning though, aren't we? Oh, oh. Uh, what are we doing now? We're going to go back home. You've got a fish and chips from last night still to eat. Well, country to country today was kind of shit. It was disappointingly, and it's like I said earlier, it's kind of what you've got to expect though. If you are not 100% with the lineup, you may struggle with it slightly. But Cat House was great. Cat House was good. <laughs> we look awful in this shot. We do. <laughs> Why did the Photoshop like Ant and Deck onto our face? When I say Photoshop, I just meant like add it. Okay. Right then. Feeling very fresh considering we were out till about four in the fucking morning. Yeah, we were, baby. Uh, yesterday was a real slog. It was very rough, but yeah, I feel it was difficult yesterday. I feel a lot better today. Today I'm going to hear not a single song I've ever heard before in my life. That's a lie. Why? Oh, no, yeah, maybe There's not a single artist I've even heard of. No, that's, actually, that is a lie. Why? Oh, because they're going to do cover of 9 to 5 by Dolly Parton or of Ring of Fire. <laughs> yeah. Good point. <laughs> Back again, King Tuts. Come to my favourite place to eat in the whole world, and I do mean in the whole world. If you are ever in Scotland, come to Bucks Bar. It's fucking outstanding. I love it here, and I'm going tomorrow. Last time we were up in Scotland, I had it four days in a row. Good God, and that's a lot. Of <laughs> it is a lot of chicken. It's just great. Big up the Bucks. Not sponsored. Email me though if you do want to. At Bucks Bar, they've got like a hot rack where they've got loads of different hot sauces. And guess what? One of the hot sauces are the bomb. Now, if you don't know anything about the bomb, go onto the second channel, The View from the Afternoon, and you'll see loads of idiots try this on some hot spicy wings. Original idea, Original invented idea. by me. We need to find a vibe, and we haven't found one yet today. So I've got uh, a bar called... <laughs> 
I've got a bar next to my hotel called Who and Annie's and I thought, you know what, that sounds vibey, so we're going to check it out and hopefully it'll make these two miserable cunts What happy. do you mean? I'm literally fine. <coughs> I'm not hanging out with you two ever again. <coughs> Good God, <laughs> shut up. Oh, that didn't go down well, that. You're right. And I'm just coughing. <laughs> <laughs> What's your excuse? Oh, my bit, bro. <laughs> you should go to doctor, man. Oh, yeah, sorry, doctor. I fucked up my throat, <laughs> so now I've got a cough. so slowly. <laughs> Tasted delicious. <laughs> right, what are we doing? <laughs> Get the... <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> are we going to the... Let's go to the Hydro. Okay, I'll book us a car. Are you alright to get in a taxi? Yeah, I'm just having a coughing fit. Yeah, but what you, what you have another one and get in the taxi like that? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, put your hand over your mouth afterwards. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Jake's buying some merch. Oh, what? He's buying the deadest bit of merch that they sell. <laughs> No. We say it every year, but I've actually bought some merch this time. It is only a shitty lanyard. That's because you don't get a ticket for this event. And I like to do a little frame at the end of the year, so I can put that in now. Here's something I didn't know about the Hydro. When you're in the lounge, each night there's a, a show on. They do a cocktail specific for that show. So they're country-themed cocktails. This is the Mando. It's gin and it's on screen now. If I didn't know any better, I would say that's just a pint of fresh orange juice. That's pretty good then. Yeah. The banjo. The cheers. <laughs> The place we're sat in at the minute is called the Hydro Club Lounge. Uh, we've talked about it a couple of times. This is like my fourth or fifth time in here. We don't come in here very often. To get an annual membership, to sit here and pay for your drinks like anyone else would pay for them outside, £3,675 plus VAT, which is this much in total, just to sit here. You do get some other perks. You can buy any ticket you want at face value and You've got access to some good seats downstairs, but if you're someone who prefers standing, I just can't fathom why you would spend £3,675 plus that on this. It's nice, but I'd rather have fucking three bags in the bank and... Three what? Three bags. Bags of what? Bags is how you say a grand. You would know oh. once you've got a grand to your name. You Sorry, how many bag. times has your card declined today? Yeah, shut up. So me and Ryan, we're gonna go see an artist called Lauren Elena, who I really like, I think she's pretty cool. One visual thing I've seen is, this is the busiest it's been at this time, half six. Absolutely love fat breast. Big fat breast. Breast of itchy. <laughs> fat breast of itchy on a capital breakfast, of course, in Scotland. And I remember her kid calling me the N word. 
didn't offend me at the time. And I went back home and asked my mom what it meant, and it took my little brother to tell me that we didn't have the same dad. Mary, yeah. what did you think of C2C Festival? Honestly. You know what? It was uh, <coughs> it was really nice to see people there who love that. And mm -hmm. There was, for example, there was a couple in front of us, mm -hmm. and me and Rob were debating whether to take a photo of them. They were like, an, an older couple, I'd say like in the 40s. And they were so sweet and like loved up and they knew every song and it was just nice looking around and seeing everybody having a great time. It's not my kind of music. I didn't know the words to the songs and but some of them were great. That last guy, what was his name? Kate Brown. Down. He was a really charismatic, nice guy. Um, Sorry, that, that, that what are you all saying just been rudely interrupted by Rob's fat. Oh, can I just say I, something on me. that? Can I? I was just, I was gonna tweet <laughs> about it because you know it's not me. He is so <laughs> Who is it then? obnoxious. It and isn't me. I I've needed so fat. You just squeeze your won't you? Yeah, you just hold it in. Have some grace and decorum. Dear Lord, what a sad little life. This fucking. I think he could be meeting the fucking queen if she's dead or the king. He'd still let one out. And I'll tell you what, it's so easy to identify because it smells like stale burnt it's sauce. Dust, it's dusty. It's, it's, it's like the the intestines of a man who's never eaten a vegetable in his life. He Absolutely. is just it's so rotten and awful. It makes me wanna hit him because it's like People are gonna think that's me. Mm -hmm. It's just us together. People are gonna think that's me. You need the, the, to. The into the same be, can this be an intervention for him? Because he is really unhinged. His asshole needs clenching. And if he doesn't clench it, no. <laughs> <laughs> no that would have been. What are you looking at me for like that? Just disrespectful. Uh, he, he always is. He, he like he goes like. Mm -hmm. and he looks away, and I'm there like <laughs> looking at him, and I'm like. And he'll turn, and he has this little smirk that comes on, and you know it, you every time. <laughs> It's so is, rude, Rob. It's so bollocks. rude. And you know what? You're better than that. After all I've done You're better you. than that. You're better After than that. No, I'm sorry. You're better than that. And we're yeah. better than better, we're better than hanging around with someone that does that. Better, I think we need to drop him. I agree. Please. If he needs if he keeps <laughs> dropping him, we're dropping him. <laughs> I can't do it anymore. It's really humiliating. Go on. Go on. Go on, what are you gonna say? Whoever smelt it, dealt it. Oh well. I didn't know it would play by that <laughs> rules. You are you a dirty bastard fiend of farts. You really are a rotten bitch. Ladies, my Instagram is open. <laughs> if anyone wants to send me a message, just let your ass will be sure to ignore it. <laughs> <laughs> Do you have a pass for us to get in? Yeah. <laughs> Sorry guys, I, I was just thinking about the project that we're doing right now. Yeah. But we can't get in there without you, can we, you fucking... <laughs> Two seconds then, but to do to your job. Are we meant to walk in? Just say hello, It's your job as well. It's, an, it's a cycle that just can't be won. You're filming, we need to go in. You need to see us go in, but we can't really? get in without you. <coughs> God, God, stop, God, stop you coughing, stop man. man. <laughs> And she was like, we've got tonic. I'm like, I'll have a double gin and tonic. Something I don't even like. So now I've got a double gin and tonic. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm for a piss. Okay, enjoy. Let us know what the toys are like. Please, 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 please
I'm worried about him. I'd be worried about him. Look at him. Between us two, when we brought those, I mean, between us, all of them. <laughs> we, we brought, I brought those things over and, and you, you were like this in the corner. Like, I was literally filming you bring them over. Thanks so much everybody for tuning in once again for another week of nonsense. We had a lot of fun at this event, particularly Jake and Mary. I struggled on the second day, but the first and the, and the final day were great. Um, real good fun, and for the most part, I enjoyed the country music. Jake's a big country fan anyway, so uh, I think Mary will be, will be swayed. As I've hinted to a few times in this, uh, in this video, we've got a big country video coming later on in the year, so hopefully that should be a big hit and get us a load of the uh, Southern American audience. I want to say a huge thank you to all the names on screen right now. Uh, without you lot supporting TPD TV with your very, very hard earned money, we would not be able to do half of the shit that we do. Um, we really do owe you everything and we're super super grateful um, whenever I meet someone out and about when we're when we're on site and stuff and they tell me they're a patreon I'm always really touched so thank you so much um, this video didn't have a sponsor we wanted to get it out quickly we've, we've decided that putting out stuff out of season hasn't really worked for us so we instead of waiting for a sponsor to you know earn some more money we thought let's sling this out give the people what they want um, so this video is fully funded by yourselves I also want to say a massive thank you to our dear friend Ryan who when we were gonna do country to country we were we were debating between doing Scotland and London and if we'd have done London it would have probably cost us about 1500 to 2000 pounds more um, and by doing Glasgow and by Ryan helping us out and being so kind to to let us stay with him and sorting our tickets out, it really kind of made a difference and means that this video will, uh, you know, not be such a, a colossal black hole of, of money. So thank you very much to Ryan. Uh, thanks everyone that's watched this far. We got some great shit coming. I think this was a good start to the year. Uh, we're starting earlier than ever. By the time you watch this, I'll be in France at Tomorrowland Winter with a great gang of lads. So can't wait to show you what we've got coming. Love you and leave you. And uh, there's the badge there just in case you missed it. See you soon.